Hi, I'm Dr. Shah. I was the National Lecture Competition winner in 1989, and I'm the Maths Master at Maths School. Now, ready for a new way of doing maths? Synthetic division. If you've already watched the video on how to do polynomial division, then this is exactly the same topic, but just a speeded up way of performing that same calculation. So, I've given myself the same example as we did when we did the polynomial division, the same cubic, and we're dividing it by the same um, linear divisor. I'm going to start off in exactly the same way. Put my cubic inside my division, and my linear outside of the division. Now, when we're doing um, synthetic division, what we're largely doing is we're ignoring the x's in, the, in, this, um, in both of these equations. So what I'm going to do is just put a 1 in front of that x cubed, and then I'm going to just rub out the x cubed, rub out the x squared, rub out the 4x, and rub out that x there. Okay, so what we're doing is just looking at the numbers, and that's why it's a speeded up version of the same calculation. Step one, you have to change the sign of this number at the front. So that's the very first step. I have to change the sign of that. So at the moment it says plus two, I'm going to change it to a minus two. Okay. So important first step, we must change the sign of that number. Next thing I'm going to do is take this number here, the very first number, and then just push it straight up at the, to the top. I need a number at the top here before I can start doing synthetic division, so I just take that number and push it up. And then I multiply 1 by minus 2, which gives you minus 2, write it underneath the second coefficient, and then add these together. I'm adding them this time, so plus 5, add 2, gives me plus 3. And then do the same thing again. Multiply that into there. So 3 times minus 2 gives me minus 6. And again, adding these two together gives me minus 2. And then again, the same step, multiplying it into there. Minus 2 times minus 2 gives me plus 4. Now there are no more digits at the end here, so I'm just going to stop here by adding these at the bottom and put my 5 here. Now I want to put back in all those x's. So I'm going to put that back in again x, I'm going to put that back in again, x cubed, put that x squared back in, put that x back in, and also at the top here I'm going to put an x squared, an x, and the last one's going to be a unit. So I know the last one's going to be a unit, so that's got to be an x, that's got to be an x squared. And now we have the same answer as we had before, that is our quotient, and that is our remainder, and that is synthetic division.